Yeah. Is this loss something or nothing? It's nothing yet because of what Popovich said and did, right? You know, it, it, it would be if, it, and it will be, if they don't learn from it. And what do they have to learn? Stephen A., this is what I said from the beginning. When we stop, start messing around and sending less than our very best, which this team is, this is not our very best starting five, right? Our best starting five would be Steph Curry and James Harden and Kawhi Leonard and LeBron James and Kevin Durant. And we would never lose an exhibition. It doesn't matter what would happen. But that's not this. Uh, yeah, you can mess around and lose. Mike Brown is an NBA coach. He's coaching that team. They have a half a dozen guys in the NBA on the roster. The international three-point line is closer, making everyone a better shooter. And you saw that also. And so... Yes, this Team USA is in greater danger than iterations we've sent when we've really sent our very best. That said, as long as they get serious, they should still win. If they don't take it seriously, maybe not. But as long as they get serious, they should still win. And so because of what Popovich said, I don't think this is something yet. Oh, it's something. Oh, it's something. Uh, but, it's, it, you know, listen, here's the reality of the situation. Um... I don't give a damn what anybody says. You shouldn't need your very best to win gold in Olympic competition. But let's go over this roster just a touch. I mean, Middleton, Drew Holiday, Devin Booker are playing in the finals, so they'll show up there once the finals are over. But let's put this in its proper perspective, Max Kellerman, Molly, Karen Rose. Um, they have Kevin Durant. They have Damian Lillard. Mm. They have Bradley Beal. They have Jason Tatum. I'm sorry. I really, really, really need LeBron James and a few of the creme de la creme de Giannis. You know, not that Giannis would be there because he'd play for Greece. But I'm just saying, when I'm thinking about it, I don't have enough. Are you kidding me? That is ridiculous. The reality of the situation is, is that when you look at certain players that we talk about, we might talk about tier one or whatever, but when you talk about bona fide, bona fide stars in the National Basketball Association, we can pick at least 15 to 20 of them. Half of them are on this damn roster.